Legislative IQ. Increase your legislative intelligence with Florida's policy, budget, and campaign monitoring service. Subscribe today at legislativeiq.com. What's going on with him? I don't know. The, the the driver's side window is all bashed in, and he's got blood all over his head. That was part of a 911 call from July 18, 2014. A neighbor found Florida State law professor Dan Markell in his garage. He was shot twice in the head. It was a murder mystery with minimal information for 22 months before two men were arrested and charged with killing Markell. And on the two-year anniversary of when Markell was shot and killed here at his house, one of the prime suspects in his murder appeared in court. Sigfredo Garcia's case management hearing Monday morning lasted less than five minutes. His attorneys requested a speedy trial. Our primary objective at this time is to familiarize ourselves with the state's discovery. And so that's what we're going to do. We're going to let our actions in the courtroom kind of speak for themselves and focus on the case. And that's kind of all I can say at this point because we literally just got the evidence in the case yesterday. The request was granted. Garcia's trial begins November 14th. That's a strategic move that we made. Police believe Garcia and another man, Luis Rivera, were hired to kill Markel two years ago. Documents show a suspected connection between the family of Markel's ex-wife and the accused killers, but other arrests have yet to be made. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Matt Gelka.